Hello everybody! This video will tell you about deleting files and folders from your hard or removable disk without the opportunity to restore them. There can be various reasons why you want to do it. For example, when you lend a computer, hard disk or flash drive to another person, when you send a computer or drives to a repair shop, or when you sell them. Conventional deleting of your data with standard operating system tools or even formatting the drives cannot guarantee that the data is deleted forever. In most cases, deleted data can be recovered with special utilities such as Hetman Partition Recovery. For ordinary users, the most popular way to delete data permanently is using specialized software. There are many free products to help you do it. Looking ahead, I'd like to say that there are not the only way to prevent recovery of your data. Please watch this video till the end. After some time spent on searching, we managed to find out that the most popular products of this type are Eraser, CCleaner free version, Free File Shredder, Free Razor, and others. You can find the links to download these programs in the description. I'm not going to show you all the programs, but I will concentrate on the most popular two. In order to delete data forever with CCleaner, start the program, go to the menu Tools, Drive Wiper, check the box next to the drive where you want to delete data forever. In our case, that is USB drive E. After that, decide what you are going to erase – free space only or entire drive. Specify the erase method – 1 pass, 3, 7 or 35 passes. The more passes, the more reliable is erasing, but it will also take longer time to complete. After that, click on Wipe. Enter a standard code word to confirm and click OK. The erasing process starts. The operation is completed successfully. Now it will be impossible to recover any data from this drive. In order to delete data uh, forever with Eraser, start the program. In order to erase data from a drive, click on the arrow next to the menu Erase Schedule and select New Task. In the window that opens, assign a name to the task Disk E. Select Run manually. After that, click Add Data. In the window that opens, specify the data you want to erase forever. Data type – Files in folder, Recycle bin or Drive partition. I choose Drive partition. Now erase the method. This section is more varied than in CCleaner, but the principle is the same. The more passes, the more reliable is erasing. You should also select the drive, so select Drive E again. OK. OK. In order to start erasing, right-click on the task we have created and select Run now. You can see the progress bar on the right. Now erasing is complete. Uh, one of the standard functions uh, of Windows is the Reset function. It can be found in the menu Settings, Update and Security, Recovery. If you click on Get started, the system will suggest you to choose between Keep my files or Remove everything. You can also clean the system drive or clean all drives in your computer. Anyway, the main function we are interested in when talking about removing files forever is this one. Remove files and clean the drive. When you select it, all data on a chosen drive will be deleted forever. Watch another video on our channel to see how to reset your computer with removing files and cleaning the drive with the help of this function. You can find the link in the description. If you want, you can use another Windows integrated tool, BitLocker, to make files in your computer inaccessible to anyone but you. Here is what I mean. You need a password to get access to files in the disk encrypted by BitLocker. If the password is lost or entered incorrectly, you will need a key. If there is no key or password to the drive encrypted with BitLocker, the only way to access such drive will be after formatting it, but it will delete all data. Even after that, 
all encrypted files will remain encrypted, and they can only be recovered if you have the key. You can learn more about protecting a drive with BitLocker in another video by our channel. You will find the link in the description. That is all for now. If you like this video, click the like button below and subscribe to our channel to see more. We'll be glad to answer any questions in comments. Thank you for watching and good luck!